Hey guys, school starts in a few days, so I'm gonna do a what's in your backpack type video where I show you what you should bring to school in case like something happens or what you need for school kind of video because this is the last weekend of school, I guess. Last, the last video was the summer vacation video. So, no, the next video is the summer vacation video. So I'm really excited uh, for school to start, but I'm also nervous too. Anyways, see you in the video. Weird sad. This is the first video on my new phone, actually. So I haven't recorded a video on this at all yet, so I hope the audio and video is okay. I think it is. I don't know if you can see my face, but hi, I'm here. Uh, I'm gonna do what's in my backpack. Tori didn't have time. I'm leaving in like 10 minutes, so. Supposed to have this nice backpack. It's like this, right? And go watch the haul for this year. If you don't know what's in here, but I have those full four folders: binder, four notebooks, this little notes thing. Remember this? A planner, and then two pencil pouches. Where's my other one? Okay. Oh, found it. Okay. That's what's in there. You already know what's in there. The regular school stuff that you need. Then this top one, I don't have anything yet. I might need something later. So I don't have anything yet. And this one here, this is where I usually keep my, I bring toys to school sometimes. You guys know stress balls for big cubes, fidget spinners. Uh, I keep all that in this type of pouch. So I have this french fries squishy medium rising, I like medium rising ones. And then always keep an emergency kit. So just in case like uh, you need a hair tire, need deodorant right away, you have it in here. Or for me, so don't judge me, I keep spare underwear because you never know what's gonna happen. Is there anything else in here? Not really. Oh yeah, and my ID, you need your photo ID, so I bring that in here. There's a spot for it in here, actually. I'll show you guys that later. But for this part of my bag, I like, because if you put something in here, you don't want anybody like, because at my school, people will unzip your bag and then stuff will fall out everywhere. You don't want that to happen while you're walking through the halls. Get one of these things. It's not like a padlock, because most schools don't allow padlocks, because you could keep some stuff that's not allowed on school property in there and then you'll like be sent to the office but it doesn't even really look like a padlock it just looks like a thing hanging off your back so what i do is if i'm going through the halls and someone's been annoying me with my bag i put this thing on so now no one can quickly unzip it but what what oh right it doesn't cause suspicion for the teachers. The teachers are walking by and they just see, oh look, that's a cute thing she has dangling on her back. They don't notice that it's through both of them. Just keep it more towards the top since this one's pretty big and you put it on the floor. You don't want it to like get all dirty if someone like trips on it and then the bag goes flying everywhere, you know? And this front one, I just have girl stuff. In the side here, I have lotion actually right now. I have lotion in this side one right now. I'm gonna put it somewhere else. And then this side one here, I don't have anything yet, but I think that's where I'm gonna either keep my lotion or my wallet or my phone I don't need. So that's like a what's in my backpack, backpack tutorial. Hope you guys in video. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, it was kind of short, but it is the last back to school video of the back to school season. Sadness, but we're going back to school soon. I know a lot of people are going back to school soon. Especially a lot of people watching this are going back to school soon. And I did get a new phone. Audio and video is a lot better. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and